Four, listen. A. Listen to two friends talking. What is Larry's problem? Who is Larry? Larry is a boy, the one in the picture. He has a problem. He is in trouble and he needs help. He is a friend in need. What is his problem? Try to listen and figure out. And then, take the things Larry decides to do. All these are different things. Larry didn't decide to do all of them. No, Larry decided, chose to do only some of these actions, some of these things. Which ones? Will he do this? Yes, put a tick here. Will he do the second one? Put a tick. Now let's read these things together. 1. Search for advice online. Look for help using the internet. Search the internet for help. 2. Take the shirt to the cleaners. A cleaners is a place where you can get your dirty clothes cleaned. You take your thobes, your clothes to this cleaners and you pay money and they clean your clothes for you. 3. Tell Jim what really happened. Just go to Jim and tell him the truth. Will he do that? We'll see. 4. Give Jim one of his shirts. Larry is wearing check shirt at the moment. Will he give Jim one of his shirts? 5. Buy a new shirt. 6. Treat Jim to dinner. Treat Jim. Take Jim. Invite Jim to dinner. Okay, even before we listen, by reading and understanding these sentences, it's obvious that uh, his problem is he took uh, a shirt from Jim and then he made it dirty. He made it a mess. He ruined it. Before I play the recording, let's read this tip. While listening, don't assume that an answer is correct. Assume, think. Don't think that an answer is correct just because the speakers mention a word that is in the activity. What do we mean by that? Like you go ahead and you read this, search for advice online, and then you hear in the recording, you hear someone saying, okay, I want to search for advice online, and you think, okay, he said it, so let's take this. No, just make sure that he decided to do it for real. In the end, okay, maybe somebody stopped him from doing that. Like, okay, no, don't do this. It's a waste of time. And then he said, oh, okay, I will not do it. Listen carefully before you answer. Let's listen to the recording together. Hi, Larry. What are you doing there? I'm trying to clean this shirt. Look. Give up. I don't think it's working. Their problem is, it's not mine. Oh. I borrowed it from Jim last week. And now look at it. What am I going to do? He's going to kill me. Calm down. We'll think of something. Maybe I could find more information online about how to clean it. You can try, but I don't think it'll work. You're right. That's a silly idea. What would happen if I took it to the cleaners? Do you think they could clean it? I doubt it. I mean, it's a mess. Oh, no. What am I going to do? I'd deal with the situation differently if I were you. How? I'd tell him the truth. Just explain what happened. It was an accident, right? Yes, it was. He'll understand, won't he? Of course he will. I know. I should give him one of my shirts. I'm not sure he'll want one of your old shirts. You're right. OK, I'll promise to buy him a new one then. That's more like it. And you know what else I could do? What's that? I'll take him out to dinner on Friday. There's a new restaurant that he really wants to go to. Why not? You can treat me too. Why? For giving you such brilliant advice. OK, were you able to find Larry's problem? Were you able to find out which things has Larry decided to do? Good. No, listen to the recording again and try on your own. If you listened again and you want to check your answers, then follow me. 
Here is the listening transcript. Liam and Larry are talking. Hi, Larry. What are you doing there? I'm trying to clean this shirt. Look. Give up. Forget about it. You will not be successful. I don't think it's working. The problem is, uh, it's not mine. I am not the owner of this shirt. It's Jim's, not mine. Oh, I borrowed it from Jim last week. Borrow? Like, I took it for a short time to wear it and then give it back later to Jim. And now, look at it. It's gone bad. What am I going to do? He is going to kill me. He loves this shirt. Calm down. Relax. We'll think of something. We will figure something out. Maybe I could find more information online about how to clean it. Maybe I should use the internet to find a solution for my problem. You can try, but uh, I don't think it will work. I don't think it's a good idea. You're right. That's a silly idea. That's a bad idea. What would happen if I took it to the cleaners? Do you think they could clean it in the cleaners? Mm, I doubt it. I don't think so. I mean, it's a mess. The shirt is a mess. It's gone very bad. The best thing we can do is just throw it away. Oh, no. What am I going to do? I deal with the situation differently. I would solve this problem, the problem that we have, in a different way. If I were you, if I was in your place, how? What would you do? I'd tell him the truth. I would not lie to him. Just explain what happened. Just tell him all the details about what happened. It was an accident, right? You did not mean for that to happen. It happened against your will. It was an accident, right? Yes, it was. It was an accident. I do not mean for that to happen. He'll understand, won't he? Of course he will. He will understand. I know. I should give him one of my shirts. Okay, I have shirts. I ruined one of his shirts, so I will give him one of my shirts. Mm, I'm not sure he will want one of your old shirts. Your shirts are very old. Uh, you're right. Okay. I'll promise to buy him a new one then. Promise I will give him a man's word, man to man. I will say that I will buy you a new shirt. That's more like it. That's a better idea. And you know what else I could do? What's that? What else can you do? I'll take him out to dinner on Friday. I will invite him. Take him to dinner with me. There is a new restaurant that he really wants to go to. Why not? You can treat me too. Take me too with you. I'll come. Why? Why would I take you for giving you such a brilliant advice? Because my advice is great. Awesome. Take me with you. Now, let's get back to the actions. Which ones did Larry decide to do in the end? Search for advice online? No, he thought it's a bad idea, silly idea. Take the shirt to the cleaners? No, he thought that uh, they would not be able to clean it. Three, tell Jim what really happened? Yes. Just go to Jim, tell him the truth. Four, give Jim one of his shirts? No, his shirts are old and the idea will not work. Buy a new shirt for Jim? Yes, that's more like it. Six, treat Jim to dinner? Yes, he would take Jim to dinner. Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, please share it with friends. Goodbye.